baby. Me to uncle told me from Kuto by enough. We to win a two city, two city, and me to win. Me to uncle Tony check, me to me to never do ten years. Debbie, I'm a coach, my mother, 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 he knows that in Ghana, if you want a better and a correct shea butter, medicated one, you can only get it from the north side of Ghana. And she's also from the northern side of Ghana, where he, she was born and raised. So she believes that this business is, is good for her, and then she has been in the business for 10 good years. So, Marin Ghana is here to um, give um, live update on how they process it. Uncle Tono, who are Driano, who are Driano, who are Darsan, Chipen, now Yenisano, now Fabum, Darsano, now Fabum. Yeah. Okay, what she's saying is that um, the shea butter is made from a particular tree, and that tree they don't add any chemicals to it. So um, they go for the tree and then cut them into pieces and then grind it with a grinding machine. And after that, they will put it in a um, pot and then cook it for hours. And then after that, it will melt. And when it melts, they will go for everything from the pot and then put it in a cool place so that it will um, form into its solid um, state so that's what she's saying and i love um this shea butter because i know it's the original one and she's saying that it contains no chemical this is locally made from ghana from the northern side of ghana ready yeah so um this woman is saying at first um it's not easy to get the shea butter but now people has discovered that it's so important for the human skin so now people are into the business i mean more people are also selling it now so it has increased it has decreased the market level so now the market is not good only that she visit one or two of her customers and then they will get some and buy so